Hi. In this video, we want to talk about styling the text inside the table. So, for the first time, we style the table. For example, we want the width of the table, uh, we format the header, and so on. But what is very important uh, when we use uh, repeatedly a table into a project, maybe we want to change something in our table and we will need to change that in the next table and so on until the last one. So uh, we will see how hard it is to change the text manually and how easy it is to combine tables using table styles and inside the text inside to have styles. Uh, so let's fill this table with some text. Uh, we did it manually, but for the, uh, the rest of the text, we want to use a styles. So imagine that I have this table um, more times here. So I have the table here and the same table, uh, so almost the same table uh, down there and so on. Let's, let's copy first the table. Okay, again. So let's suppose the text is a little bit changed, similar, but the same uh, style. So we decided to change the font to 11. We have to go to each table and to change the font to 11. Another much better solution is to use paragraph styles, okay, or um, character styles. Let's choose, for example, for this, uh, let's choose main index entry. And for this, let's go to right and let's choose um, variable, the same here on the right and variable. And now um, let's do the same thing on the right and variable and here main index. Okay, so it's main index. The same here, main index. And if I want to change the font, I change just once and everything is changed. I have 11 here and 11 everywhere. Let's increase the font, 20. Everywhere I change the font and the font is changed in all the tables in my project. I want 12, very easy everything is changed. So it's much easier to change like that in all the projects. So you work faster with styles. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more video. Thank you.